Get off the bus, my Get off the bus, you like to hit kids? Oh! That's only on four. Shocking video obtained by News 4 Tucson shows the moments a Santa Cruz County bus driver was attacked tonight. Law enforcement is still searching for that suspect, but one mother tells News 4 Tucson that it is her children who have faced abuse from this driver. News 4 Tucson's Chorus Nylander has the latest from Rio Rico. Those allegations have the Rio Rico community split on what to think about that brutal assault. It was an act of violence in front of a bus full of kids. You should be warned. You may find the video you're about to see graphic. Push my belly again. Hey, come on. This is video captured inside Santa Cruz Valley District Bus number 43. It's Monday during the afternoon drop off along the busy road Camino Carlampi. You can hear a student upset with the driver when suddenly. Get off the bus. Get off the bus. You like to hit kids? Oh. oh. The Santa Cruz County Sheriff's Office is still searching for that suspect tonight. The driver, they say, refused medical attention, his condition unknown. We, we are talking to the other students, we're talking to staff, we're doing a lot of uh, research on making sure that our investigation is complete. Linda Ramos's two sons ride bus 43. She says her nine-year-old son, Adrid, has been bullied by the bus driver all school year. He was choked around with his own lanyard by this bus driver. She says that happened Monday, the day of the assault. I got up one time to see where's my stop so I could go home, right? And then when I was walking off, he started choking me. And then when my brother helped me get off the bus. Rio Rico residents split on what to think. As a parent, I think I would have done the same thing. I'm a little bit concerned because there's like two sides of the story. So we really need to know what really happened. Linda says she reported incidents to the sheriff's office before. And nothing was done. Chief Deputy Castillo says they received a report from her March 21st, but she wouldn't allow them to interview her son and threaten legal action. She reported the alleged choking only about a half hour before the assault on the driver. You don't take this type of allegations uh, into your own hands. Whether it, it did happen or not, let, let law enforcement intervene. Chief Deputy Castillo tells me they are actively investigating the allegations against the bus driver just as they are investigating the assault against him. Reporting from Rio Rico, Cora Snylander, News 4 Tucson.